Equilactin, also known as polycarbophil, is a medication used to treat constipation. It is classified as a bulk-forming laxative, which means it works by increasing the bulk in your stool, helping to promote movement in the intestines. In addition, it also helps to increase the amount of water in the stool, which results in softer and easier to pass stool. The recommended daily dosage is typically 2 to 6 tablets or capsules, taken with a full glass of water. It is best to take equilactin with a meal or snack, and it is important to drink plenty of fluids while taking this medication. When taking equilactin, it's important to follow the directions given by your doctor or on the product package. To avoid choking, make sure to take it with a full glass of water or other liquid. The dosage will depend on your age, medical condition, and how you respond to the treatment, so it's important not to take more than directed. Keep in mind that equilactin may affect the absorption of other medications you're taking, so be sure to ask your doctor or pharmacist how long to wait between doses. It may take 1 to 3 days for equilactin to start working, so it's important to take it regularly at the same time each day. Do not take this medication for more than 7 days unless directed by your doctor. If your condition doesn't improve or gets worse, or if you experience bleeding from the rectum, be sure to contact your doctor. If you think you may have a serious medical problem, seek medical help immediately. Gas or stomach cramping may occur when taking equilactin. If these effects persist or worsen, it's important to seek medical advice. Remember to take equilactin with a full glass of water or other liquid to prevent choking. If you experience symptoms of choking, such as chest pain or difficulty swallowing, seek medical help immediately. Serious allergic reactions to equilactin are rare, but if you notice symptoms such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing, seek medical help right away. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so if you experience any other effects, contact your doctor or pharmacist. Before taking equilactin, it's important to let your doctor or pharmacist know if you have any allergies, as this product may contain ingredients that can cause allergic reactions. Also, make sure to inform them about your medical history, especially if you have stomach-slash-intestinal blockage, difficulty swallowing, appendicitis or symptoms of appendicitis, a sudden change in bowel habits lasting longer than two weeks, bleeding from the rectum, high calcium levels, or kidney disease. If you are pregnant or breastfeeding, consult your doctor before using this medication. As for the daily dosage, it is recommended to follow the instructions provided by your doctor or the label on the product. It's best to take equilactin at the same time each day for the best results. It can be taken with or without food. Remember to drink plenty of water while taking this medication to help prevent dehydration. Equilactin is commonly used to treat occasional constipation and to maintain regularity. It works by absorbing liquid in the intestines and swelling to create a softer, bulky stool that is easier to pass. It may also help to relieve symptoms of hemorrhoids and anal fissures. It's important to note that this medication may take 12 to 72 hours to produce a bowel movement, so it's best to plan accordingly. If you miss a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If it is near the time of the next dose, skip the missed dose and resume your usual dosing schedule. Do not double the dose to catch up. Be sure to check the How to Use section for more information on how to take Equilactin. It's important to be aware of any potential drug interactions, as they can affect how your medications work or increase your risk for serious side effects. Remember to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. It's crucial not to start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. If you or someone else has taken too much equilactin and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, call for emergency help immediately. In the U.S., you can contact your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. Canadian residents can call a provincial poison control center. Be sure to keep all of your medical and lab appointments. In order to prevent or relieve constipation, making some lifestyle changes can be helpful. This includes exercising, staying hydrated by drinking enough water, and eating a proper diet with fiber-rich foods such as bran, fresh fruits, and vegetables. If you're looking to make these changes, it's a good idea to talk to your doctor or pharmacist for some advice that might be beneficial for you. 
if you forget to take a dose of equilactin, take it as soon as you remember. But if it's almost time for your next dose, just skip the missed one and take the next dose at your regular time. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. Remember to store equilactin at room temperature, away from light and moisture, but not in the bathroom. Keep it out of reach of children and pets. Do not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed. When the product is expired or no longer needed, be sure to dispose of it properly. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.